Okay, so to the buyer of the pod, I want to tell them a couple things about the keys. There are uh, two keys for the doors and the back hatch to the galley. Uh, one goes to both doors and the other one goes to the galley. Two separate keys, one for doors, one for galley. And then these two keys, I'm going to go ahead and give the buyer this lock that I bought that uh, locks up in here. And basically there's two keys for that. It unlocks, this pulls out, you pull the lock off there, and the bowl drops out. So it secures it so no one can steal it. So you put it up in there like so, making sure these things are toward the back side, and then latch it and then stick this through with the threaded on the right side and voila it is locked you'd have your standard uh, safety cables and you have your four pin for your lights that plug in and you have a brand new heavy duty marine jack it goes up and down real easy when you're taking it off of this hill to the buyer be careful not to remove the blocks from in back or else it'll roll down the hill when you jack the front up to put it on your your hitch so make sure that these stay here while you're while you're raising the front up on the back because we're on a hill here and there's a trick to the back here the back one like i say one of these keys goes to the back lock and the one goes to the doors uh, let's see that's the one to the doors that's the one I just locked it. That's the one that goes to this. So that's unlocked. And then you twist it and open like so. When you open it up, you can just release these legs right here. And the legs go into these little notches here. You can do just one. You can do both sides. Um, the battery, I have a marine battery that didn't fit in the normal battery slot because it's a deep discharge, heavy duty marine battery that takes over a month to discharge, runs the lights and electrical inside. So I had to raise this up in order to accommodate the larger battery. If you get a normal battery, you can lower this back down and it'll be flush. This is a storage unit in here. This right here is a table that if you detach and grab the leg to it, comes around this side, hooks on right here with two tongues going and you have a table, screw the leg in, and you have a table that sits right along here. Um, back to here, to put it away, I told you there's a, a little trick. So basically you lower this down and if you find that this baby when it's loose it just gets it can it can go all the way around either way um, you have to find that's that's the one that locks right there if you spun it around like that and then closed it sometimes you may not be able to get it but it looks like it's working perfect just play with that it has two rods that go into the side and then I should mark these keys but that's the right one and then that locks it what should be said about the door keys is that the passenger side over there opens from the inside only. Only the driver's side over here uh, opens from the outside. I always go in and out this door. I don't go in and out the other one. Um, I have a spare tire that I brought, Kristen, that I'm going to put right over here for the buyer. This is the spare, and we'll just leave it <laughs> right over here. For the buyer and this is the stand uh, that it goes on this was right here I had the welder take it off of here so we can reattach it here or that side if you want to reverse it or up here or anywhere else that you want the tire to be the spare tire based on the configuration of your vehicle I had a Jeep, so I needed the Jeep door to swing all the way open. You saw that in the pictures on Craigslist. And that's why I had this removed, because the tire was here. And if you have a Jeep, the door won't swing all the way open. With this off, it swings all the way open. That's why we've left this up to the buyer, where they want it. The top, the tongue, in the back, underneath, wherever they want it. They get to pick it depending on what car they're towing up with. And then, uh, finally, Tarp down here. That's the tarp to cover with for the winter. You may give that to them too if they want it, just if they want a tarp to cover if they don't have a garage. And these are the mattresses that came with it. If you want to shoot in there, Kristen, 
those are the mattresses that came with it. I don't use them. I only use a uh, REI pad that's thin. You, you also saw that in Craig's list, uh, the way I had the bed. But if the people want the pads and the mattresses that originally came with it, they fold out to an entire queen. They go across both, you know, they go across the whole floor. If they don't want them, just throw them away. That's the entire thing and everything anyone needs to know for the pod. Everything else is in the ad. New leaf springs, new tires, new everything. And uh, I think you play that for them. Thank you.